Rate of closure, a very interesting conversation. How much that face is rotating about the shaft into impact. But also very interesting is how we can control dynamic loft through this interval as well. So into impact, a great drill to really control how much dynamic loft we're introducing. You're gonna be pin high a whole lot more often. You're gonna have a consistent ball speed and that ball's not gonna spin out of control into the wind. So put the club on the ground and just drag the ball the club into impact really feeling pressure on that index finger, you're gonna have a very stable dynamic loft, and you're gonna see that club stays outside the hands a little bit longer. It hasn't bypassed too early. So even though that trail wrist is moving from extension to flexion and we may be giving up some shaft lean, if we can be a little bit more consistent with how much shaft lean we have through this interval, even if that face is rotating a little bit, we should still be very, very consistent when it comes to rate of closure. So, just a different way of looking at it. Give it a try and good luck.